So Whitney, tell us a little bit about who you are. I'm Whitney, I'm from Brisbane, I'm 26. I've always loved health and fitness. I've been involved for about seven years now and I just love seeing people transform, whether it be their health, their mindset, and I'm just I'm so curious and I love learning about it. So Whitney, what started you on this journey about health? I guess I really think about that and how I really got involved at such a young age and I really think it's from my grandmother actually. I remember her going through a, she had a triple heart bypass and I remember being so young and just wondering why, um, just why, you know, like there's, she was the most healthiest person in my life and my role model and then seeing other people in my family have these health issues. My mum had cervical cancer and it just made me really curious at a young age, like why does these things happen? And I think from 16 I got straight into my Cert 3 in fitness, my Cert 4 after school, working at Fitness First. It did start with my mum, you know, she's like, let's do these diets, let's do these shake diets. Whatever you can think of, we did it. In high school I was always, always thinking about how I looked and how I felt and I was just always curious, like how can you just feel good, do the things you want to do in life, eat with the family and do all these things without worrying about what I look like or how my clothes felt. I started watching all the personal trainers, you know, these guys are experts and I was trying everything that they did. So, you know, everyone knows the chicken and broccoli, the oats and to be honest, and it's pretty embarrassing, when I did that, I ended up at the doctor's because I hadn't gone to the toilet for two weeks. And I was in so much pain, I was so bloated. How am I supposed to become a PT and help people when I've tried literally everything under the sun for years? And I just felt like my money was just going down the drain. I just wasn't getting anywhere for a long, long time. And would you say that today, Health is too much focused on body image and not enough about how we feel? Yeah, oh definitely, like I look back now, like I used to do the two hours of training all the time and really focusing on the fitness. I really found it really comes down to the basics of nutrition. I do go out with the family, like that's half the time you go out and eat with the family, like and back in the day I would miss out on those things because I didn't want to ruin whatever silly diet I was on and that would be so frustrating. Now I'm a really big advocate of fasting. Um, but it was only a year ago I added medical grade water and to be honest I'd never even thought about what it had to do with our health. Um, I used to just drink tap water because I thought bottled water was a waste of money. But then once I looked into it it was actually looking for something natural for my pop who's sick with shingles at the, um, the time and what I came across was this medical grade water machines in hospitals all over in Japan. and. Oh, the studies behind it, I just couldn't stop researching, I was so curious and for me, without even trying the water, I bought two machines, one for myself and the whole family and also my grandmother as well and I just can't believe the changes we've had in the last year. Um, my grandmother's now off her high blood pressure tablets, same with my granddad. Um, my granddad has only really been on it for the last four weeks and um, you know every day he's supposed to look at this white card and see these black dots which he's never been able to do. It's only recently he yelled out mum you know he couldn't believe he could finally see the black dots. It's just the best feeling being able to help them um, after everything they've gone through everything they've done for me I guess everyone just wants to give back to their family and I just feel like a winner even when I bought those machines you know ever since then it's really enhanced my health and where it's been and I see so many people spending money on so many supplements and what's the next best thing and so many diets and they're the people I really want to help because I was that person for so many years and I know what it's like to feel unhappy and always conscious of how you look or how you feel and you know now that I've gotten that lifestyle in the last couple of years and that body and I feel good inside and out. I just want to share that with other people. I just want to buy more machines for my granddad and the rest of the family because it's, you know, their health we're talking about and I want them to be here for as long as possible. Um, so I'm just so grateful that I think everything happens for a reason and I'm just so grateful I came across that 
and it's just been a blessing for not only me but my whole family. I just can't wait to share it with more of my family especially but also my friends that I know are looking for a solution as well.